Yo ho ho my fellow felines and welcome to some Christmas content from your favourite West Lothian based football club which isn't Stonyburn United. We are here at the Tony Mac Aroni Arena ahead of the Livingston ladies training session on a cold Thursday night. But Jake, why are we here? Thanks Liam, we are here because the ladies and the men's team are sick of us talking about them on our wee podcast. So we're here with the Lionesses to be put through our paces with a drill delivered by none other than a Livingston FC superstar. Yes, he's Fee Banff, he's a Fee Bonnie and he's a baller. It's the Bonnie Banff baller, Bruce Anderson. Get the way. Right, we're sick of you talking rubbish in your podcast so we set up a few drills to put you through your paces. Right, we're ready. As assistant to the stadium announcer, I'll do the honours of reading the lineup for the opposition. Starting in goals this evening is the media man himself, Mr. David Badura. And lining up for the Lionesses this evening is goal scoring extraordinaires Ashley Elizabeth and Jen Dodds, <laughs> defensive deputy Jess Murphy, playmaker Shannon Mulligan, and the skipper Natasha Frew. Jake, why don't you introduce us chumps? for the fellow felines watching at home. Well, quaking in their boots for the Almond View boys are myself, Jake Pointer, a dynamic mix between Nicky Devlin and Lyndon Dykes, Leo Minnis, Attila Christen's long lost brother, Thomas Froh, dreams about being David Fernandez, Owen Innes, has posters of Jackson Longridge on his bedroom wall, and Mr. Stephen Povey, who once scored 25 goals in a single game of five sides. I absolutely don't believe that for a second, but apparently Liam was there. I'm not good to go. I never got a set like that. Oh. Any chance of me getting a set like that? Oh! Pick your ankle up! That's in the box. That's astonishing! <laughs> the goalie's almost took his face off the post. I can't believe I'm drawn with him. He's beat me. I'm going again. You just do what you want. No, I think seven out of ten. Time fault. It's got to be a time fault. <laughs> Look, he's blowing. Change your goalie. 
Put a mannequin in goals. I don't want to embarrass myself before the video. Oh, what's that shit? That's for the camera. That is the camera, right? Like. Come on, keep up! Please, Hack, please! That's it! Come on! Oh! It's Sean Kelly! <laughs> Who's your goalie waving at? Oh, oh. finish! Oh, oh. oh save goalie! Yeah. Oh. That's it, that's good. Oh, oh. 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 <laughs> the post! <laughs> you none! I need to go again. Well, let's just finish up here with Tony Mack. Bruce, what would you rate the album view's performance out of 10? Uh, I'd give you a 4 out of 10. I thought it was more abysmal. It's better than we expected. Well, please reveal who the winners were today. The winners were the women's team. No, no surprise at all. Ladies and gentlemen, thanks so much for watching. You've been watching You Ken the Drill. Done. Sorted. Done.